wanted me to finish off with a song with vocals or something. No, I did want to explain tomorrow night we'll do some, the first set will be a lot of some country and it'll be different, a little bit different from the night. The second set will be strictly classical, not, you know, my own stuff. I mean, you know, 12th century French, Persian, you know, Grey on the Lotus, yeah, right, all kinds of stuff. I wrote a new song called Omar Khayyam Country. And I got to try it out somewhere. And this is a nice house, you know. <laughs> but, you know, I mean, I'm getting sick of Frankie and Johnny being the love trist of North America. You know, it's a drag, you know. <laughs> we got to do something about that. We're too strung out as a country to have any insular, you know, love matches get nationally known or something. But anyway, I don't know how we're going to do that. <laughs> you know, <it's>, well... <laughs> Oh, you got to get a really good-looking president and a good-looking president's son, and he flips out over a beggar maid or something, you know, or a bureaucrat's daughter or something. I don't know what we're going to do it anyway. I don't know how this country will ever... Evangeline was cool, but you have to know, you know, it's Creole French and everything. Okay, let's see. Okay, here we go. I walked out unto the garden, the garden in May. I picked a rose that was waiting and gave my heart away. She was red, she was winsome, she was white to my soul.
On the day that we parted, I cried the whole night through. I wondered if the curls of love would always be untrue. Then she rose from the ashes like the sun. For goodness sakes, tell your friends to come tomorrow night, because if you don't, I'm going to have to take Greyhound all the way back to California, and Chuck's going to have to find a new place to live. <laughs> so really, please tell folks to come, and I think we'll have a beautiful time tomorrow. Thank you very much.